Hello painting peeps and welcome. It's Kathleen from Cos Creations. Welcome to the No Bra Zone guys. I am glad that you are here. Just got back from a, uh, a little weekend meeting my daughter halfway there in Virginia. I'm in South Carolina but she was visiting a girlfriend of hers that uh, grew up with my daughter. They were best friends, Miss V, and I met them halfway at Miss V's brand new home down in Whispering Pines in North Carolina. She lives on a beautiful lake and we did some paddle boarding and I gave a lot of mama love and got to hang out with my G-baby and uh, it was a great time. And I'm back and when I got home there was this wonderful box of paints waiting for me that I am really excited about using. These paints are from Christina Welsh and it's Porridge Pose. Pose or Posey, Christina? I'm not sure. Paints. Uh, Christina and her husband and some good paint peeps of her have a YouTube channel and I have watched their auctions and I believe she does like a Friday night live where she paints live and auctions things um, off and she's a very talented artist and she's got a, a good support team behind her. Maria, thank you for all your help always. And her YouTube channel is wonderful, her Facebook page, and I came home to this beautiful box of paints. And they're yummy. I haven't opened them up yet, but I am going to do a little experiment with them. Now, she sent a lovely little card just thanking me, and a little note here that says, when mixing metallics and shimmers, add paint with Floetrol first, equal parts. Once you have it all incorporated, add the same amount of glue all. You can then gradually add Floetrol again to reach consistency. So, I don't use glue all. Nothing wrong with glue, using glue all. I just don't use it. So what I'm going to do is I am going to do per instructions. I'm going to put my paints in a cup, add some Floetrol to it, mix them up, and then I will top it with my usual pouring medium, which is 75% Floetrol and 25% Golden GAC 800. Actually, let me rephrase that. Um, my pouring medium, oops, I don't know what that noise was. My pouring medium is 50% Floetrol and 50% Golden Gloss Pouring Medium. I bought that on sale when I was in Savannah visiting their live, huge, fantastic Blix store. So, um, Let's just take a quick look at these paints. First of all, the presentation of them, they're absolutely lovely. They come in these little baby mason jars. They were wrapped with such care. Christina, it took me an hour and a half to get these darn things unwrapped. There was so much love when they were shipped off to me, but what's beautiful, yummy colors. Now, I know that Christina sells her paints as well as her mixed paints. In other words, you can also buy these with the pouring medium already mixed in, and I believe they come in those wonderful squeeze bottles. So I'm excited to try them, but let's just look at a couple of these colors. Alan's Red Shimmer. Now, Alan is her husband, and uh, he's always there participating uh, with her during her lives. We've got Henna Clay right here. Christina's Laguna Shimmer. So she's got some nice metallics, some regular, ooh, this one, Deep Lagoon Shimmer. I'm gonna put this one right over here because <laughs> I think I'm gonna use that. This is Coral Reef Metallics. Persian Autumn Yellow. That's a beautiful shade of yellow. I don't use much yellow, but that is pretty. Snow White Iridescent Pearl. Victoria's Muscadine Wine. Oh, that's got me written all over it. Gold Rush. Sleeping Beauty 
turquoise shimmer, military green shimmer, that's a pretty green, guys, chestnut bronze, oh, that's got my name on it, I'm going to stick that one over here as well, dark chocolate shimmer, that's definitely got my name all over it, I'm going to stick that one right there. Copper Penny, I am a copper girl. That baby goes into the mix. And Moody Blue Shimmer. I grew up listening to the Moody Blues. <laughs> I love the Moody Blues. This is going into the mix as well. So, Christina, thank you so much. Maria, once again, thank you for all your help always. And I am going to go mix some paints. I think I'm gonna use a black base coat we will revisit the colors that I chose and we're going to do a little testing. I'm excited, guys. Thanks for being here. I'll be right back at you. Okay, guys, I am back. We are all mixed up and ready to go. So let's talk about what we have here. Right here is the Moody Blues Shimmer. Very nice paint. These guys are, let me open up a a lighter one are so rich so creamy very easy to mix but very thick I mean look at that that ain't moving these are some thick paints and I am hoping that they dry as well as they look because these are some pretty colors so that is the moody blue shimmer this is very pretty this is the Copper Penny. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to use this or not. I will see. This is the Snow White Iridescent Pearl. Very nice paints, Christina. This guy right here is another copper called the Chestnut Bronze. It's just a little bit deeper. And I love my blues and my coppers and my browns together. This is the Dark Chocolate Shimmer. Is that upside down? I don't know. <laughs> and then I also have in this pretty cup because I wanted a lighter blue and I did not have one. So I mixed up some Deco Art uh, Dazzling Metallics Peacock with a little bit of the golden turquoise just to richen it up. I said earlier I was probably going to do a black base coat because I just got my long awaited for artist loft black in the mail but after mixing these guys up I thought you know what I'm going to do them on a white base coat. So our base coat today is artist loft flow acrylics in the white. So I am going to go ahead and prep my base coat on this 12 by 16 Blick Premier Gallery Wrap Stretch Canvas. I love these canvases, guys, and when they're on sale, they're well worth grabbing. They feel good. They've got good teeth. I like these canvases. So I'm going to go ahead and get everything prepped, put some music on for you, put some music on for me so I can dance around because I've been away for a couple of days and I'm happy to be back here. And we're going to paint. Let's get busy, guys. Give me something, something good.
You're still, still, still with me all the time. about this crooked canvas throughout. It's so hard to look up there and see what you're seeing and all the mess down below. So uh, these are nice paints, guys. Um, I did a little swiping through things. There's no silicone. You can see that it's celled up where the copper and the blue met. Um, the colors are very vibrant very 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 nice um the swiping with the paper towel the consistency of the paint when it hit the paper towel was perfect for me i wish i had done this on a black base coat because you can see some areas where the white is popping up um that's my bad but um 
these are rich colors. This copper penny um, rocks my world. I really love it. And this um, moody blue that's right in through here is absolutely stunning. So um, I'm grateful to have these paints and I can't wait to play with them a little more. Christina, you did a, 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 a beautiful job with them. Um, porridge Posy or Pose. And forgive me, I don't know if it's Pose or Posy paints. Um, they're fantastic, guys. I hope that's not upside down. I'll do it this way, and I'll do it this way. So um, this gets a thumbs up, guys. Um, I'm not a sponsor of any of the paints that um, I share with you. I try them. If I like them, I tell ya. If I don't like them, I usually don't do a video on them because I don't want to make anybody sad. But uh, these are very, very nice paints. Christina Welsh, check her out. Check out her paints. Um, I used just about a half an ounce of paint to an ounce of Floetrol, and then I added my PM. 50% uh, Floetrol and 50% Golden Gloss Pouring Medium to my cup until I got it to the right consistency. And they were actually a little bit thicker than what I'm used to. That's why you saw me add my uh, diluted base coat around the pour that I did. Um, I just wanted to see how they moved on the dry canvas as well. So. Um, Nice paints, guys. It's a thumbs up from me. Um, thanks for being here. <laughs> I'm always glad when you do, and I think I'm going to go mix up some more and do a little bit more fiddle, and I think I'll try it with a swipe. So I'm excited. Guys, thanks for being here. Happy Sunday. That's if it's Sunday once I finally get this video edited. Good to see you all. Be safe. Be happy, be well. Thanks for joining me.